Okay, so this is a quick tutorial on how to um, use Adobe Scan. Um, as you can see to my far right on the phone, I have Adobe Scan and I'm going to click it. So once I would have clicked it, let me come out of here and go to my home page. It's going to ask, excuse me, it's going to ask me to scan a document. So I'm going to hover over the document and I'm going to take the picture of the document. With this, you see that I have the ability to adjust exactly what all I would want to have within that scan document. I don't want to see any of the table, so I'm just adjusting. And I'm going to click continue. As you'll see to the bottom, I have one document. So I have a few options here that I can adjust. I can crop it and then rotate it. I can also continue to crop it if after I've taken the photo I notice it's not the way that I want it to look. But this is fine. So I've rotated it so now it's not twisted the next way anymore but rather it's looking directly at me. I can change the name. Let's label this test. All right, and it has a date. And then we save it as a PDF. So when we save it as a PDF, you'll notice here that it joins all of our other um, scan documents. Um, I use this for every single thing that I need scanned. Let's click on more. In more, you will see where it says copy to device, copy, save pages as a JPEG. That's um, terminology for pictures. You can modify it, meaning if you forgot to do something or you'd like to add pages to it, you can go in and um, make some adjustments. You can rename it or you can send it directly to your printer. Okay, so if I would want to share this to my Google Classroom, I would go to share, share a copy. And I have so many options here of where I can share it. Um, Adobe Fill and Scan, that's a document that you can use to fill out um, PDF documents. So if someone sends you a contract to sign or if your teacher sends you a PDF and they want you to fill in the blank spaces, you simply can use that app. But you have the ability here to send it to Google Classroom, you can send it to your email, you can send it to your drive, um, wherever it is that you need to send it, it's probably right there. So let's try Google Classroom. So I can create an assignment, and as you can see, it automatically attaches, all right? automatically attaches to my assignment area. So if I'm sending this to a student, I just automatically send it directly to them. And of course, you know, you have the ability to send it to as many um, classes as you would want to. So let's say you have one document you would want to share with a few of your classes. You simply go to the top screen here, the top left, where it says Teachers of MCPA. You click down and all of my classes are here. So I just would select and then click done. But this is just a tutorial for me to show you that. Or let's say you have some students that did not sit a quiz and you'd wanna just send it to them individually. So instead of all students, you would untick that. All right? Alrighty, so this is just a tutorial on Adobe Scan. And that's basically everything right there. Have a great day.